uh, it's it's great to play for old time dances again. I was I moved away for a few years and and I uh, came back about three years ago, and it's nice to get back into the old time dance circuit, and meet some new friends now that I'm back here in Manitoba. And I met some great people recently that uh, have come to be really close, and they're almost like surrogate parents. We have uh, they're here dancing all the time, and it's Julie Cook and Albert Todd sitting right over there. Say hi. And I told Jeremy one day that I wanted to write them an old-time waltz. And it just so turned out that Jeremy had a waltz going through his head, and he said, well, what do you think of this one? And I said, wow, that's beautiful. But he didn't have a second part. And I said, well, let me write the second part, but when you're a musical genius, when music comes to you, you can't help it. So he said, well, I already have a second part. It's too late. I can't wait for you. So he came up with the second part. <laughs> well, I'm not living a little bit. But uh, it's, it's just a, a little waltz that, that he wrote for Julian Albert, and we call it Julian Albert's Waltz. Because the second part's a little bit shifty. <laughs> so we named Julie first, <laughs> and we'll leave the shifty part to, to, to Albert. So we'd like to get them on the dance floor and do this old-time waltz. 